in the budget on the issue of sick pay um, because now the Institute for Fiscal Studies has said that actually a scheme of being able to refund companies that are paying sick pay might take months, um, not weeks. That's going to make things very difficult, isn't it? It is going to make things uh, difficult because uh, there is always a lag. But for me, the question of sick pay is more profound than that because there are two million people on low pay that don't have access to sick pay. And even people who do have access to sick pay will be uh, being able to take home £94 a week. Mm. And so actually for the average worker, that's about two thirds of their income slashed. And when you think about most families in the country, they're living hand to mouth. There isn't a huge amount of savings going around. And so that sort of economic hit for a family is going to be absolutely catastrophic. And you know, in Ireland, the Irish government took the step of increasing statutory sick pay in order to mm. mitigate that. And our government and our budget haven't. And so for me, there will be a business impact without a doubt. I think the economic impact of this is going to be hugely profound because the fundamentals were quite weak. But it's the impact on families that I don't think we began to start uh, grappling with.